Did you know that almost every form of illness and dis-ease is a result of toxicity overload? Typically one or a combination of three. Or three like that. <laughs> Hi, I'm Neil Cannon, the author of The Vitality Secret. And I'm Dr. Nikki, the founder of Dr. Nikki Talks Health. We'd like to discuss with you some really wonderful ways of getting your body back into balance so you can actually become free from just about any illness or dis-ease or any kind of ongoing symptom or even the side effects of medication. For the best part of four and a half years, I've been helping people reverse a whole collection of illnesses by helping them understand that every illness is a result of the same underlying cause. And this was almost by accident for me. I had eczema for the best part of 30 years and I accidentally discovered that it has an underlying cause when I was actually researching the condition my father was diagnosed with a few years prior to his stroke. And since 2015, I've been helping people reverse all kinds of chronic inflammatory health conditions. So what is the underlying cause, Neil? Well, I may have given the game away then. Inflammation is typically, you may have heard this word a lot, it's kind of spoken about a lot, but it really is the underlying cause of so many health conditions uh, when, when it comes to the treatment of common illness and chronic disease, this is really the underlying cause. And I'd like to challenge that a moment because that is a symptom, maybe, of an even deeper underlying cause, right? I'd agree with that, yes. So uh, under that level, inflammation is usually the body's response to something, a triggering cause. Yes. And that generally is toxins in, in your environment. There are three ways toxins get in through your food, what you actually consume, what is in your environment, what you lather on your skin, for example, and your toxic thoughts. Yes, right? thoughts and emotions. It's fascinating, actually. This is part of my research in the last couple of years, which has really come into the forefront of my attention, realizing how much influence our thoughts and our emotions have on the biology of our body. Would you say more so than nutrition? I would argue more so now. If this was, if you asked me this three years ago, I'd have said nutrition, everything is about nutrition and gut health, all about nutrition. Now I'm saying, yes, nutrition is super important, but I'd almost argue that our chronic thoughts, our chronic emotions have more impact over our biology than just about anything else. In, in practical real life terms, yeah, if someone's eating everything organic, healthy, straight out of the land, fresh produce, and yet is drowning in these toxic thoughts, right? Of, of self-destructive style thoughts, then you could still create a manifest illness, even if you were eating everything perfectly. So yes, I would completely. agree with you. Yeah, mm. good. Yeah. yeah, inflammation is really, in its simplest form, the body trying to protect you from kind of alien or foreign invaders or right. some form of toxic overload and stress. And if we were to go further, which we will in another video, talk about how these emotions of stress trigger a different cascade of chemicals and hormones in the body right. to say chronic emotions of say love and appreciation, care, compassion, all those higher vibration emotions. Yeah. So we are living in very fortunate times to be alive right now when we have the science of epigenetics, which is giving people their power back. And this, is, this has been around for a few decades now. And it's really about how it's the environment in the body that signals the genes, which then determines our health. It's that our genes themselves have very little role to play. We have a blueprint, if you like, but it's the environment in the body that signals the genes. And this is true for at least 95% of all illness and disease. And in less than 5% of all illness and disease, they are a result of genes which are fully penetrant, which basically means some in that proportion of the population, <laughs> I'll do this a lot, way too much. I'm about to do it again. Uh, in that proportion of the population, they are essentially born with defective genes. There it is. So in <laughs> less than 5%, those? which means that in at least 95% of cases, this puts us back into the driving seat yeah. to take our power back and harmonize the environment in the body. My, my word of the year has been harmony, actually. And it's all about creating mm. harmony in the body, whether, it, whether it's what we're eating, uh, the environment, as Nikki, Dr. Nikki talked about, whether it's internal, external, and also how our thoughts and emotions and really how connected we are with our, with our heart as well. But that's going quite deeper. So we have an immense amount of power to shift the environment in the body to create harmony 
So we get rid of inflammation and we get rid of symptoms and yeah. pain and even medication on approval of your doctor, of course. And quite simply too, that's the fun part is it's easy replacements of what you might be eating now with something that's so easy to replace. It's delicious, right? I made you a meal yes. the other day. It was brilliant. Yes. And this is the amazing thing because I, a lot of times people think we have to go on a diet to get better, but it's just as Dr. Nikki said, we can replace things so easily. Yeah. And she's actually going to show us in some videos in a, in the next session of videos, um, how to replace certain food types with healthy options which don't trigger an inflammatory response yeah. and we just it just requires a bit of creativity in the kitchen and it's just making a few changes rather than sacrifice yeah. so that brings us on to the next point we have created a small collection of or a sequence of videos covering the three main toxicities and the solution <laughs> three toxic i don't know why i can't with my thumb three forms of toxicity and how to get over them so you bring the body back into harmony again so we have created this sequence and you can find it and watch these videos. They're very short. We know time is valuable and no one has a concentration span any longer. So we are going to invite you to enter your name and email address below and then you'll be taken straight through to the first below. We'll be taken straight through to the first video, which is all about inflammation and causes, root and, causes and food. It's the one. Nutrition. Nutrition. <laughs> so check it out. Enter your email address below. It's going to be a valuable little sequence of events or videos. And we do have an opportunity after the third one for you to join us on a new year program to bring your body back into balance so you can become free from illness, pain and medication. Sounds delightful. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Thank you. Enter your details below. <laughs> Ciao.